Hi, welcome to my channel Technologies in Industry 4.0 today, in this video I will teach you about the chatbots technologies in the daily life you will also saw the chatbots in the Facebook, other websites, and helplines. So, let's start the video. What is chatbot technology? Description a computer program that puts on a human conversation over voice commands or text chats or both is called chatbot. This is a software application used to provide direct contact with a live human agent. It is a great feature of artificial intelligence, AI, and natural language processing that may be embedded and used through any major messaging applications. The chatbot systems usually need constant modification and testing. There are many chatbots in production that remain unable to sufficiently pass the industry standard Turing test. Uses and Benefits Dialogue systems use chatbots for numerous purposes such that customer service and information collecting. Certain chatbot applications use wide word classification processes and sophisticated AI. Some chatbot applications use just scan for general keywords. They produce responses using common phrases found from a related library or database. Utmost chatbots are retrieved online via website pop-ups or through virtual assistants. They may be categorized into use categories. Those categories are commerce, education, entertainment, finance, health, news, and productivity. One of the greatest used chatbots to convert more website traffic. Use chatbots to elevate customer service. One way we see contemporary support teams adapting is to use chatbots as the first line of defense. Development. Early chatbots, Eliza, 1966, and Perry, 1972. Recent notable programs included ALIC, Jabberwacky, and DUDE. Nowadays, many chatbots include other functional features for example games and web searching abilities. Certain new modern chatbots also associate real-time learning with evolutionary algorithms. These chatbots enhance their skill to communicate based on each conversation said. There is still present no general-purpose conversational artificial intelligence. The software developers may emphasize the practical aspect and information recovery. Deeppedia shaped a chatbot during the GSOC of 2017. It can communicate through Facebook Messenger. Facebook opened up its developer platform in 2016 and presented to the world what is possible with chatbots through their Messenger app. Google also became in the game soon after with Google Assistant. In the meantime, there have been marvelous quantities of chatbot apps built on websites, in applications, on social media, for customer support, and countless other examples. AI Chatbots AI chatbots are absolutely attractive. They're correct on the front lines of artificial intelligence and human intelligence. Nowadays, chatbots may do it all from helping us order a pizza to guiding us through a complex B2B sales process. Different kinds of chatbots are built to do diverse types of things. AI chatbots can understand language outdoor of a set of pre-programmed commands. They continue learning based on the inputs it receives. They can make changes based on patterns as they experience new situations. Fundamental Concepts Pattern matching. This is based on illustrative stimulus response blocks. In pattern matching, a sentence is entered and output is created consistent with the user input. The first chatbots developed using pattern recognition algorithms were Eliza and Alice. The artificial intelligence markup language, AIML. This was created from 1995 to 2000. It is built on the ideas of the pattern matching technique or pattern recognition. It applied to natural language modeling for the dialogue between humans and chatbots, 
which monitors the stimulus response approach. It is tag based and an XML based markup language. Latent Semantic Analysis, LSA. This can be used together with AIML for the development of chatbots. It is used to learn similarities among words as vector representation. By using AIML, we can answer template based questions like greetings and general questions. Though, the other unanswered questions use LSA to give replies. Chat script. This is the replacement of the AIML language and is an expert system. It consists of an open source scripting language and the engine that runs it. It is included of rules which are associated with topics. ChatScript similarly contains long term memory in the form of dollar variables which can be used to store specific user information like the name or age of the user. RiveScript this is a plain text and line based scripting language for the development of chatbots. RiveScript is open source through obtainable interfaces. The available interfaces are for Go, Java, JavaScript, Perl, and Python. Natural Language Processing, NLP. This is an area of artificial intelligence. It discovers the operation of natural language text or speech by computers. The knowledge of understanding and usage of human language is collected to grow techniques that would make computers understand and operate natural expressions to perform wanted tasks. The greatest NLP techniques are based on machine learning. Natural Language Understanding, NLU This is at the essence of any natural language processing task. It is a method to implement natural user interfaces for example a chatbot. It has aimed to excerpt context and meanings from natural language user inputs that can be formless and respond suitably allowing to user intention. It classifies user-determined and extracts domain-specific entities. An entity. This is a tool for removing parameter values from natural language inputs. For better understanding, consider the sentence, what is the weather in England? The client determined to obtain the forecast of the weather. The entity value in England. So, the user requests the weather forecast in England. Contexts. These are strings, which store the context of the object the user is mentioning to or speaking about. For illustration, a user may mention a before-defined object in the following sentence. A consumer can input switch on the fan. Here the context to be saved is the fan. Therefore, when a user says, switch it off as the next input, the intent switches off may be invoked on the context fan.